I haven't seen you for a while. How's it going? Yeah, I'm very well. Thank you. I was That's very good. busy at some point, but yeah. I'm very, very well now. Have some more time. What have you got going on at the moment? Uh, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna sign up for some design designer courses. Oh yeah. Yes. That would so be I'm good. You excited. wanted to do that, right? Yes, I'm very excited about that. Very cool. What else? Nothing. Not much. Enjoying nice weather. Just very happy. Mm. How are you? Yeah, pretty good. What's going on? Um, nothing. I'm not that busy. Kind of relaxed, uh, enjoying life. Have some trips planned and stuff. Mm. Do you have anything nice. planned? Holidays or anything? Uh, this weekend I'm going to music festival, mm -hmm. and I was gonna ask you to come. Uh, oh, I'd love to come. Uh, no, I was gonna ask you to come and to take care of my cat. Oh. Okay. Do you have free, some free time? Just a few times during this weekend to come and to cook for it, for to Tom. Cook? Yes. You mean open the tin and like? No, what? no, 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 no. He's not eating that. No, oh. no, of course. He needs uh, you, to, somebody to cook for him. And I was gonna ask you. And I don't know, just spend time with him, stroke a little bit, you know, put him in the bed when he falls asleep. Can you do that? You'll like it. He's very sweet. Yeah, sure, I can do that for you, of course. I don't mind doing that. Um, I could you. ask a favour in return as sure, well. Sure, sure, no problem. Because you've got, you've got these lovely lips and it would be great if you could just give me a blowjob one time quickly. Like, we just find a time that's good for Are you. Are you serious? Yeah, you're not joking. now, no, in you're a joking. coffee shop, but another day. Sure, I'm your friend, Richard. That's why I'm asking you, because it's been so well, long. Friends and don't do this for well, each other. Just, just make an exception, because it's been a while, and look I at your believe, sexy I lips and stuff. I can't believe what you're saying. Be, I'm sure you're great at it. You're sick. Just quickly. I don't want to talk to you. Just once. Talk to no, no, no. I don't want to And I'll look after your cat forever. Well, it would be nice if that was the way the world worked, but it's not. And women don't think like that, and there's no place to bring it up. So keep choosing those in the game, but in real life, never. Well, to be honest, I, I always did think about doing things with your pussy, but not cooking for it. What? Richard, it's me. Yeah. Me, your you're, friend. But you're very attractive, to be honest, and you know yeah, we spend a lot of time together. For how many years? Spend a lot of time together, and sometimes at night when we're not together, I kind of being friends doesn't mean to do these kind of you. things for each other. And you know, you've got that picture on Facebook in your bikini and stuff. Yeah. You just look really sexy on it, and I just imagine. I'm, like, I'm happy you like me and you like off. my body, but no, 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 yeah, no, no, I do. no, I don't expect that from you. Well, it's not really nice. What do you think, though? What do you mean, what do you think? It's you, no. Maybe we'd... Never ha will never happen. Never? No, just friends. You know, friends, friends. meeting for coffee, looking after cats, things like that. So you're addictees, basically. You just meet me, put these sexy pictures on Facebook, know that I'm thinking about you. You're mental? What's wrong with you? Just a man. Let's change the with... subject. Now that's pretty much how it would play out with most girls. They're just not ready for that level of crassness. Not again. All you ever do is just ask, like, take advantage of my feelings for you. Because, you, you know, you just... Your Always feelings getting... for me? What kind of feelings? Um, friends feelings. Yeah, yeah, of course. Best friends feelings. This is what best friends are for. Yeah, maybe. As much as that might be true, it's not the way to say it, is it? So you want to get what you want, but in a smoother way. Sure. Uh, what are friends for? Yeah, exactly. 
Thank you. Thank you very much. Don't be such a doormat, pushover, wet blanket, damp squib, all of these things, basically a wussy. You can do better, um, be a bit tougher, have more respect for yourself. Try it again. If you want to get out of the friend zone, it's the only way. Yeah, of course I can do that. Yeah, no problem. I could come even twice a day, like in the morning. And Thank when you when very does much. he eat? I don't know. Two morning, evening, whatever. Uh, yeah. 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 Okay. So great. Twice, twice a day. And he likes uh, okay. tuna, salmon. Yes. Yes, salmon. His favorite dish. Okay. Great. I can. And normally, how many courses? Like one, two. Three is is okay. Is enough. Three courses. Mm -hmm. It's like an hour. Yeah, I can, I, can come, like I can kind of skip work a little bit and come. You're such a good friend. I'm so happy I have you. Nah, man, you can't give her everything she wants all the time. Otherwise, you're never going to get out of the friend zone, are you? And that's what you want. Uh, you know, I'd love to help, but actually I'm, I'm pretty oh, busy no. this week. Yeah, I don't think I'd have time. Sorry, maybe... Please think about it. Maybe you can do it. Just a few hours a day. Oh, maybe I could, but I'm not sure, you know, what time I'm free and stuff. And I don't want to tell you I can, and then your oh, cat's like waiting for I can ask you a favor. salmon and stuff, and then I'm not there, you know? Okay, never mind. You can find someone else, I'm yeah, sure. sure. Next time, next time. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we need to say no, and the you know these girls that put you in the friend zone that always ask favors and you know you're kind of chasing them all the time. The way to break out is to start treating them more like a friend rather than a girl that you're trying to date, and this is a way to do it. So it's the correct option here. Who are you going to the festival with? With my boyfriend. Ah, this guy. Yeah. Um, how yeah. how is that, by the way, relationship? It's okay. It's okay. Only okay. It's not perfect. Ah, tell he's me more. Very, he's very busy recently. We don't get enough time together. So I, actually I see him like once or twice a week. He's always in the office. Or even at, when he's at home, he's on his computer. So there is not much communication between us. So he doesn't really pay attention to you and stuff? Looks like that. Yeah, it looks like that to me. Probably his project taking too much time. He's such a dick. I think you just need to dump this guy like immediately. You're just wasting your time with him. Well, uh, yeah, it's not right? that bad. It's well, not it's not good, it's not, so... It's not a good reason to dump him, I think. Well, not good enough. What's the point of staying with some guy that's just working, he's, you know, he doesn't pay any attention to you? Text him now and just... to earn money for us. Well, that's what he says. Text yeah, him and exactly. just say, you know, no, 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 go I'm away, not do don't it. want to ever no, see I'm you again. I'm not going to do anything now. Let's just change the subject. Actually, I'll tell you what, um, I met my psychic the other day and I just happened to ask them about you, I just remembered. <laughs> <laughs> and they said um, you need to you need to ditch him as well. They said the same thing. If you well, stay if with he said what, that. what was his what was his words? If you stay with him, it will bring a hail of misfortune and curse your you to death or something like something well, like that. Did he say anything like, about you? Oh yeah, I'm all good. But, yeah, I'm good. but yeah, I just happened to ask about you because I care about you, and that's what he said. No, so. that's not serious. It is. Not, he's no. the very he, he's top psychic in the city. <laughs> yeah, so everyone ridiculous. goes to him. No, like, no. Uh, footballer. And... I'll sort it out myself. Okay. Yeah. Let's just change the subject. Okay. Yeah. You think about how you want to yeah, dump him. You can do it by text, letter, in person. Anything. Thanks for your advice. Anytime. And I'll I'll talk to my psychic again. Don't bother. Okay, you blew it, but hopefully you'll get another chance. Oh, really? He's terrible, you know? That's, um, that's just not right. You should treat not a girl better than terrible, that. Terrible? Not terrible? But oh, I wouldn't cool. say I'm completely happy, yeah. 100%. Because if it's me, I just, 
you know, I'm, I'm always thinking, oh, maybe today I'll buy flowers, maybe today I'll cook dinner. Um, what, what does she want? Maybe some chocolates. I can, you know, clean the house before she comes back. You know. Really? You would make a good boyfriend for someone? Interesting psychological point here. It's not the best choice. And the reason why is that when you join her in saying bad things, you actually cause her to defend him. Because if you go a little bit too far, say something, then she goes into the position of defending her man and therefore getting closer to him and putting you on the other side. So much better is to take the opposite tack, say good things and get her to be the one that says bad things, or just get her to open up and reveal more and tell you more of why he's bad, but not commiserate too much and not agree too much and definitely don't add anything. Anyway, let's change the subject. How are you? How's it going? Work? Yeah, it works. It's all right. I have, some, I have some interesting projects, actually. And one of them didn't work out, but two are looking really promising. And if mm. something happens, it could Exciting. be pretty big. Yeah, so I won't say more, because you know what I'm like. I'm more action than yeah, words. So true. I'll tell you if it works out. And okay. oh. Are you looking at this gun? Yeah? Yeah, I mean, she's got these really nice boobs. And start, look, can you see them like very like firm and round? I mean, I can't yeah, really. see, but if you imagine naked, I think I would be pretty good, right? Oh, but don't 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 be jealous because I'm not you've jealous. got well, of course, because you've got an amazing ass. Why would you be jealous? Oh. Do you remember that time when we did yoga together and you were doing yeah, this? Yeah, you were staring at my ass. You saw? You know, of course, you, it was mirror. Then. What is it? Cat, cow, dog. Whatever it was a cat, downward facing dog or something like this. Yeah, that is brilliant. You have to show me that some more. <laughs> sure. Brilliant. You're her friend. Why are you choosing that? It's not the time to give a compliment. It's not the time to give her validation. You want her to get out of your friend zone, not get deeper in it by just giving her exactly what she wants, but get nothing in return. That's very annoying. Because guys always do that on a date with a girl. They're yeah. checking out other girls and they think cool. girls don't see it, but they do actually. Uh, and what's the problem with that? It makes me feel like I'm not beautiful enough, to be honest. Come on, that's bullshit. Everyone thinks you're very sexy. And really? Yeah, your body and stuff, yeah. Oh. I was sitting, uh, you know my friends Alex and yes. Mahmoud and Reitgad? I was sitting with them the other day and they were just saying like, um, who was it? Either, I think it was Mahmoud. He said, I would just like to, I would fuck Lilia all day, oh, wow. all night, easy, like six easy, times, easy. You don't need to discuss And then me. Alex said he'd love to like jizz somewhere on your face or something. You and, guys don't have any other Arad, subjects Arad to talk about? was like, maybe we could all do it together, get her drunk <laughs> and she might be into that. Can you ask the wanna, next time you I see her if she likes that? I don't want to meet them and... ever again, please. Well, they want to meet you. And I think they're willing to do whatever it takes. They don't so, need to. So don't worry. There are many men are looking oh, okay. at you, checking you out, imagining sticking it in different places and all of no, that. No, I'm absolutely Nothing confident. Nothing wrong with your looks. Be Thank very, you very confident. Much. Yeah. That so sounds what, what, like a compliment to me. So look, Mahmoud's having this big party on Friday night. We're all going to be there and maybe you could come. You know, just no you and way. the boys. No, I'm not coming. I Three don't care guys. about Mahmoud Three and guys. all your friends. You never had this kind of fancy? Look, I never had this kind Let of me put it to you like this. You said you're not feeling confident. So imagine on Friday night, you've got all these men just begging to It's not going to work. Believe me. To... Shut up, please. Just trying yeah, to help no, your confidence. I mean, no, Think of it like a shirts. life coaching class to be more confident, you know? No. No, you're not Friday? Just for an hour, you can pop in. Can you hear me? Yeah, hear and I'm see. I'm very upset now. Really? 
Okay, I was just trying to, you know, help your mood no, because you please said... Please don't do anything about it. No, it's not that big problem. Okay, but just so you know, there are lots of men that like you, fantasize about you, sure. basically just want yeah, right. you. Right now, they're probably at home doing things and thinking about you. You're the one they Great think about. Great news. This is what I need to know. That's Thank okay. you very much. Richard. Anytime. I applaud your, you know, comradeship, bringing your friends into it, especially Mahmoud, you know, that guy, that guy would really be into it, but definitely no place for that kind of thing outside of the game, of course. Oh, come on, what are you talking about? You're so beautiful. You have these little elf ears and the pixie nose, <laughs> really nice teeth, That's dimples nice when you smile, you. beautiful That's eyes sweet. that just glow and amazing soft skin. And the way oh, you walk is so feminine you. and beautiful. Nice and you're really smart as well. You're so intelligent. Oh, that's a nice you have this beautiful well. voice and lovely <clears throat> eyebrows. Um, really sexy feet. I don't know if I noticed, you know, you have lovely feet as well. Beautiful hands, little soft hands, very feminine. The way you drink coffee, your little cute little hands, like little bear claws, your little feet and your ankles. You I'm know, your ankles are very, very, very nice. Much. And this muscle, nice. calf muscle is very oh. pretty <laughs> okay. when you wear a dress. And you have a long neck. And yeah, not, yeah just... like a regal neck. You know, used to be very prized amongst the nobility back in the day. Very Thank nice, very white, much. soft, creamy skin, like a baby, but sexy, not like... Thank you. Know. Thank you. Very nice. nice. Just because it's what you think doesn't mean it's what you have to say, right? Keep that stuff to yourself because what you want to do is build attraction. And you don't do that by just giving her everything even before she's with you. By the way, I saw your ex-girlfriend a few Agatha? days ago. Yes, oh. her. She was with a nice guy. Nice guy? That's yeah, nice what, one. Well, he looked good and... He did. And she, she looked did. happy. And she did. That's shit. To they look happy to me. Do you still have feelings for her? Well, I don't want to be with her, but I'd rather she was unhappy not being mm. with me, you know, than happy with some dude. Right. And how about your love life? Are you still single? Yeah, I'm single and, and you know, it's really hard because I'm, you know, I'm a sex addict and I, I, when I have a girlfriend, nice. I'm like having sex all day long, basically. And so being single is really hard. So I'm, I'm basically, you know, I'm, I'm masturbate basically like maybe 10, 12, oh, don't sometimes shit. more times per day, <laughs> you know, just uh, sometimes watch some videos, sometimes just think about something, <laughs> sometimes You're listen sick. to something, maybe remember something. Okay, stop it. I got it. Yeah. Got it. Got it. But they say it's, it's healthy, right? So it's okay. Very healthy. Yes. And uses a lot of uh, calories. Don't need to but go to the gym as much. Not healthy. No. Serious point here, guys. Actually, don't jerk off so much. Makes you better with women when you're a bit hungry, when you're out there. Um, when your testosterone's up a bit, uh, when you want sex more, you're more likely to actually even approach girls and, uh, you know, work hard to have good conversations and, and meet them. So, less jerking off. There's one guy I really like, actually, and I've, I've known her for a while. We're kind of friends, you know, we meet sometimes for coffees and stuff. And uh, she's, she's kind of the one that I want. So, so I know her? Um, kind of, yeah. But never mind. But, um, you know, I'm just waiting for the day she just realises that, you know, good old Richard, her good friend, is the one who she should be with. I hope you're not talking about me. You hope that I'm not, and therefore I'm not. So no, no. it's another, it's another girl that I meet, friends, coffee, oh, and I'd love to course. meet her as well. Oh, you'd like to meet her? Um, 
Oh, well, you know what? She she really just hates uh, people and girls especially. She just, Is she on Facebook? Do you have Facebook, any pictures Facebook. of her? No, you know what? She When she was young, someone took her picture and then they immediately died. So she never lets <sighs> anyone take their pictures. So there's nothing exists of her. No Is pictures. there any chance they can see her? Um, maybe, maybe. I'll, I'll look. I'll tell you what. I'll talk to her and let's you know forget about that. You'll you'll probably Very meet strange. her one day. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure you'll meet her. Maybe. Chill it out a bit. You don't need to be so eager. Treat her like you would treat any of your other friends. I do meet girls, but to be honest, they, they just don't really match up to, um, to you, actually. Oh. Yeah, I kind of compare... You look at someone like me. Mm, kind of close would be, would be good, yeah. Maybe you don't have to like, look for some, so many nice girls around. Well, I mean, maybe she could be like the same, but with red nails or like an inch or two yeah, longer right. or hair or whatever, but Pretty basically, strange. yeah, and it's not quite rare, right? So taking time. Okay. You heard the phrase putting her on a pedestal. Well, that pretty much exemplifies it. And whether you verbalize that or just show that with the way you look at her, it's got no place in a guy that wants to turn that friend into a girlfriend. Yeah, nothing much going on. I'm, I'm still single, looking, How waiting. Having some days? Mm, no, but maybe. There's some prospects of some chances of having some dates. Right, prospects. Yeah. Okay. Oh, really? Nothing? Not cool, no. You need to have stuff going on. There's nothing wrong with having dates. She's just your friend, right? Make her want you. She will want you more when you've got an active love life, when you could possibly move out of that friend zone, which is what you want to do, right? Okay, but not the best option here. Then your text, it sounded like something yeah. serious is going on. What, how are you doing? Serious. Not very good. Uh, why? It's my boyfriend. We it's, broke it's, up. Oh. Yeah. Oh. We did. Mm. It was actually the right time to finish our relationship, to end it. Yeah. Um, three years. Yeah, after it's all terrible. These years. Yes, I thought he, he was the right person to be my husband. Mm. Um, Not now, right? Yes, no, no, we couldn't sort out our relationship and I had to end it. Mm, that's awful. Yeah. So bad, yeah. you must be really sad. I'm very sad, mm -hmm. I'm very disappointed. Okay, well look, I've got something that might cheer you up. Hang on a second. Okay. Look what I've got for Lilia. What is that? Well, Cheers. I hope you like trees and oh. kumquats because it's a kumquat tree. Yeah. That's the kumquat tree. Yeah, you can eat them and I don't know. <laughs> look, just look at it because it's beautiful, Funny. right? You it like is. it? Um, yes, I do. Great. So, you know, remember this was like the new time in your life and it all started with the kumquat tree. I think right. it's a nice, nice thing. <laughs> Okay. Thank you. So you take it you take it home, yeah? Um I oh, will one day. I oh, will. Could you please just put it somewhere? Okay, I'll put him out I'll there and I'll home. play some classical music because he likes it. So I'll do, do that. you have a glass of wine for me? Yeah, I can get you a glass of wine. Thank you very much. Got some actually do you want kumquat wine or, <laughs> or just No, it's just just white, normal boring white dry wine. wine. Yeah? Yes, okay. that one. Thank you. I actually like this one, to be honest, but there's a better option here, but you know, I hope you enjoyed it. Okay, mm, take this. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. 
Nice, right?